The House of Comedy, the only place at the Mall of America where you can legally tell jokes. With all of its modern amenities, why go anywhere else in the mall? There are several establishments here, aside from the House of Comedy and the Hooters next to the House of Comedy. There's the M&M store, where millions of M&Ms have been sitting in shoots since the beginning of time. Clothing stores? Eh, my wardrobe is already perfect. Almost perfect. There's a garage, bathrooms, that's where they keep the trash. A lot of restaurants named after beloved parts of my childhood and the hated parts of my childhood. Coffee restaurants, moist restaurants, bread restaurants. Shout out to CJ from Panera Bread. He gave me my toast for free. Panera Bread, he is your best employee. Give him a raise so he can give me more, more toast. Legos, crayons, assorted microplastics. No matter where you look, at every turn, the cesspool of capitalism. From top to bottom, even below the bottom, there's an aquarium in the basement. A literal cesspool in this figurative cesspool. But the crown jewel, the great and gaudy bobble bolstering this bastion of banality. Nickelodeon Universe. As seen in D2, The Mighty Ducks, and D3, The Mighty Ducks, Camp Snoopy, originally. That's how I choose to remember it. It was revamped, rechristened, baptized anew. Now the theme of this theme park is pain. But life is like a roller coaster. Sometimes I feel like my life is like a roller coaster. Because I don't like roller coasters here. But I'm subjecting myself to it anyway. For content. I grieve for the good old days. Good grief. So what better place for comedy than the Mall of America, where comic legend Sinbad was beaten by an angry mob in the film Jingle All the Way. Now he can only jingle part of the way. Yeah, may, so, so yeah, maybe just stick to the House of Comedy and Panera. That's, that's all you need. A few laughs and a slice of toast. And Hooters, maybe.